Are you looking for sealed product and singles? You can find it all on Channel Fireball. Please use my Tailmon affiliate code when checking out to help support my content. Looking for PTGO codes? Photon Store has all the latest sets and promos instantly delivered to your email. You can use Tailmon code when checking out for 5% off. If you're from Europe, Millipods Gaming has a wide array of sealed products, singles and more. You can use Tailmon code when checking out for 5% off. Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. I'm in the middle of playing the Limitless Weekly uh, Tournament, but since we finish our game so quickly since we're playing ADP, I am going to be playing with Expanded Pikram. Yeah, Expanded Pikram has been doing quite all right, quite all right um, in the Expanded Tournaments and it's so versatile, it has so many options. I actually lost to Pedro uh, he completely destroyed me um, and yeah like it's so versatile right you have full blitz and you have max elixirs to power up the full blitz you have thunder mountains you don't even rely on coco prism star as much so if it's priced you don't care you have thunder mountain you have elixirs it's so good you have raichu to do paralysis and extra damage you have electro powers to boost your damage uh getting to attack bolt is quite quite easy you have Marsh Shadow GX to change your attack typing into fighting and then for the mirror match, for Zorak decks, for Snorlax VMAX, way easier to KO. You have Bolt Dunt for Electrify setting up and Bolt Storm purposes for extra damage. You have Zora Aura for free retreat. You have Beacon Bolt for item locking and Super Sap Cannon. And you have the Electros to deal with the pesky Decidio Eyes, um, which is really cool. And then you have Crobat and Tetene and Tapu Lele for support. And then Sudobudo to mess with the big bench decks. Um, yeah, it's just so many options, so versatile. Expanded Picaron feels like it's always going to be a thing. And let's check it out in the ladder. Yeah, that wasn't a very thorough explanation of the deck for sure. But I just want to keep playing. Yeah, I just want to keep playing. Uh, Charizard, yes, yes I did, thank you. They were all over the, the community, I definitely used them. Thank you so much. Yeah, I got my full art station and I got my full art research. And obviously it's great that I got those cards, but now every time I import that deck, those get prioritized and so I have to go back and switch a deck. So um, That's the bad part, right? The bad part of, um, of having those cards, how it messes with the export function on PCGO is so, so weird. It's generally so weird. All right, let's try and win some games with the Picarama Rooney. Uh, pretty decent start, I would say. I have the escape rope, so I'm gonna start this Aurora so I can power up Picarama on the bench, potentially with Coco and or potentially with uh, Max Elixirs. Did I choose to go first? If I did, that was a mistake. In Expanded, you should choose to go second. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Kuri Kuri, ¿qué tal? Muchas gracias por pasarte. That match was clean. <laughs> CBT Lexer, it was indeed. All right. So, uh, we're up against the mirror match. So we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do... Sure, let's do this, let's do this, and then we'll Crobat for four. And I guess we pass, right? Nothing else to do. That is an interesting hand for next turn, right? Um, if I had a way to discard these energies before I research, that would be fantastic, because then I would have the guaranteed full blitz. Don't have it yet. It's very likely, but drawing these three energies means my chances of hitting a max elixir are now heavily decreased, right? So that is something to keep in mind that I will need to keep in mind. Okay, Trainer's Mill for Guzma. You like seeing that, right? You like seeing that. And <laughs> not with Don CBT, what do you mean? Alrighty. How many rounds is it gonna be for today? Eight rounds, that's a lot of rounds. And I just wanna, since I've already 
I've played in a few of the weekly tournaments, and I'm pretty high in the rankings, I think. Um, I think I'm... I don't know, I was like fourth when they announced them. I was fourth when they announced them. I'm still fourth, right? I'm still fourth because I have one first place, one top eight and one top 16, I think, or top 32. So I'm just hoping to add to my points. Yeah, I would love to participate in the um, Limitless Invitational, which I missed out on last time. So I'm hoping, like, I don't, I don't expect to win a lot of these. I just want to continue to add points to my tally. I love tournaments that, that are free. I think those are the best ones. Oof. That Vika Vault is definitely annoying though. The item lock right here is definitely annoying. Because now I can't do this, I can't do this. Oh my gosh, what a top deck, man. What a top deck. Okay, give me Thunder Mountain. Give me Thunder Mountain. Nice. <laughs> oh my god, how am I this lucky? How am I this freaking lucky? Okay. So I think it's double peak arm time, right? I do think it's double peak arm. Nope, don't retreat, Pablo. Don't retreat yet. I was about to make a big oopsie. <laughs> I was about to make a big oopsie. And let's go. Full blitz. No KO, right? Obviously. I can't power up the Picarum. And the next turn I can go retreat and attack with this one. We'll see. We'll see. Ask and you shall receive, right? Yeah, I'm running incredibly hot today. <laughs> I could take to stream and play in a tournament. Could take to stream and play in a tournament. I am running incredibly hot today. A hundred theme decks, Charizard? Are you like a theme deck collector? You mean on PCGO, right? That is a lot of theme decks. <laughs> that is actually a lot of theme decks. Okay, one Electro Power. Guzma. Huh. Um. Okay. So we got wrecked right there. We got absolutely wrecked and my opponent still has the GX attack. Oof. Okay, that was not very nice. <laughs> that was really not very nice. I don't have Guzma though. Okay, I'm definitely gonna do this. I feel like I should do this. And then this, and then I'll let it change. I'm looking for Guzma. So Quick Ball, Ultra Ball, Lele gets me there. Didn't get any of those though. <laughs> what? What the heck? Did not get any of those. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I still have enough, right? Shall do it here. I'm in trouble. I'm definitely, definitely in trouble. I'm gonna do this, then I'm gonna research. Do I have Grape Catcher in this? No, I'm pretty sure I don't. Ooh, I could Electric Swamp. Put the KO. Doesn't seem great though. Hmm. Taking a return kill with Vika Volt would have been the play, I guess. Taking a return kill with Vika Volt would have been the play. Okay, so I'm just gonna full blitz. No energy left, what? What? Okay, well that's a good prize. I did prize a bunch of energy then. One, two, three, four, five, six. I played 12 and four, so I prized three energy. 
Okay, the cool part is I can one kill the Pika, right? So I'm gonna have to go KO plus N and hope for the best. <laughs> and hope they with Guzma. Uh, yes, the next Tableman challenge is tomorrow. That is correct. That is correct. All right, so there's a full blitz. Yeah, it's gonna come down to the... Um, to the Kuzma, right? Can my opponent find Kuzma? That is a question. One, two, three, four, five. I'm definitely not using this guy. I do have N, so it's N and hope, right? It absolutely is N and hope. Okay, so we're doing this, we're doing this. And then we're doing these. For this. And then I guess I'll keep the quick ball. Okay, and then hope. N and hope. Always a good plan, right? Always a good plan to go N and hope. So we do this, we go lightning ride, we get the KO, we have the Kuzma. So you can have Crobat. So one VS Seeker does it, I'm pretty sure. Right? One VS Seeker does it for my opponent. Didn't send the wall plate immediately. I actually don't have Guzma. <laughs> I actually don't have Guzma. Uh, why would they promote Crobat though? And not Zero Aura since Zero Aura can just like retreat. Um, they got the quick ball, they got the Dene. One VS Seeker does the trick. Two Guzma down, zero VS Seeker down. Maybe my opponent doesn't play VS Seeker. Maybe my opponent doesn't do VS Seeker. I never thought of like, wait, what? Oh, the Guzma. They attached energy to Zerara. That's a waste. Plays a muscle band. If they got it, then that's unnecessary <laughs> to do. They did immediately play it. So, all right. We'll take that. We'll take that. We get a return N to one. And they didn't get a switching card, so... Yeah, that, that was... I don't know. It's fine, I guess. It's whatevs. There we go. GG. Bye-bye, Crobat. That was, I mean... Just like in standard games come down to boss, this one came down to um, Guzma, right? My opponent found Guzma, they would have won. They found Guzma early on, which gave them an advantage. Then they whiffed it later on, which made it so that I was able to uh, to win. The energy in the prizes could have been an issue. I Thankfully, I did have enough uh, energy switches to pull me through that game. And since round three is coming up soon, and I probably won't have time to play another game, that will be all for Expanded Pikram. Shorter video, but an interesting game nonetheless. If you're watching on YouTube, don't forget that I'm giving out a daily code, or not a daily code, rather. In every video that I post, there is a code given out by Potan Store. Um, fantastic sponsor. They give you 5% discount when you use code Tailmon. So in order to be eligible to get the code, you need to be a subscriber to a channel and then just leave a like and a comment. Any comment on uh, the video works. Yeah? And if you're live watching with me on Twitch, thank you so much for watching. I feel like you guys probably uh, merit codes as well. So I'm gonna be giving you codes throughout, um, throughout the day. Yeah, And I will be back when round three begins.